Hello, I'm Emily Lytle with VOA 60 America. Vice President Mike Pence assures that the U.S. will stand by South Korea President Moon Jae-in in continuing pressure on North Korea's nuclear and ballistic missile program. South Korea looks to the Olympics as an opportunity to pursue diplomatic solutions. The U.S.-led coalition in Syria conducts retaliatory air and artillery strikes against pro-regime forces with approximately 100 dead, according to a U.S. official. This would be the largest amount of pro-regime casualties caused by the U.S.-led coalition. The Senate and House are voting on a bipartisan deal that will raise military and domestic spending by $300 billion over the next two years. House Speaker Paul Ryan told radio host Hugh Hewitt that he believes he has the votes to avoid a government shutdown. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.